It's impossible to cover every detail in the short amount of time you have with your doctor during an office visit. It takes years of training to become a cataract surgeon. How much time do you get with your surgeon? Maybe 15 minutes? So if you're trying to become a more informed patient so that you can ask the right questions when you're with your surgeon to get the best outcome possible, then you're in the right place. In this video, we're going to count down our top five secrets that every patient should know before having cataract surgery to make sure they get the best outcome possible, customized to their eyes, vision, and lifestyle. Let's get started. To learn more about modern cataract surgery from some of the leading cataract surgeons in America, and to find a surgeon near you, visit bestcataractsurgeons.com. What do we mean by secrets? We mean the things that are a level or two deeper than most patients and doctors are able to get to in that routine cataract evaluation office visit. There's only so much that a doctor can cover in that amount of time, and a lot of this includes the basics of cataract surgery. So here are five of the most important details that patients looking to be more educated should know. Number one, hitting the bullseye. Surgeons and patients both want to hit the bullseye perfectly with your new lens implant. To accomplish this goal, your surgeon will take a bunch of measurements before your procedure. Our modern measurement technology is better than ever before, but unfortunately, it's not perfect. There are also patient factors that can make the measurements less accurate, such as having an irregularly shaped cornea or an extremely long or short eye. When you're discussing your lens implant and vision goals with your surgeon, such as whether you want to be able to see far away after surgery or up close without glasses, you should ask your surgeon two important questions. Number one, what are the chances that we're off target? And number two, if we're off target after surgery, what are we going to do about it? Which brings us to number two. Number two, touch-ups. While the vast majority of patients hit their target with their lens implant, we want 100% of patients to reach their vision goals. And sometimes that means it may take a touch-up or an enhancement to get there. There are many different ways to do touch-ups and every patient is different. But if you are more nearsighted or farsighted or have residual astigmatism after your cataract surgery, LASIK or other laser vision procedures are a common way of fixing this to increase your freedom from glasses afterwards. What's most important to know is that if you are one of the small percentage of patients that have some prescription left over after you receive your lens implant, there are often routine ways to fix it if you're under the care of an experienced cataract and refractive surgeon. Ask your surgeon if they have a plan for touch-ups or enhancements if they're necessary. Number three, not every surgeon does every lens implant. There are so many implants on the market today and a lot of the basic monofocal lens implants are extremely similar. There are many patients who have an implant from one company in their eye from cataract surgery 15 years ago, and they get a different lens in their second eye more recently and can't tell the difference. On the other hand, there are more advanced lens implants like multifocal or extended depth of focus and adjustable lens implants that are quite different from one another and you will want your surgeon to be an expert about all of these. There's no one size fits all best lens implant, so going to a surgeon with expertise in a wide array of implants will give you the best chance to get matched with the best implant for your eyes. Number four, fix your astigmatism. Almost every patient has corneal astigmatism. This is different from the astigmatism that may or may not be in your glasses or contact lenses. The astigmatism in glasses or contacts is a combination of your corneal astigmatism and the astigmatism from your natural lens inside the eye. These can often balance each other out. Once your cataract is removed, all you're left with is your corneal astigmatism. For your best vision after cataract surgery, you'll need to have your corneal astigmatism managed. This can be done with either toric lens implants or reshaping the cornea with a laser or special blades. Based on the preoperative measurements on your cornea, your doctor can match the right technique up to your eyes. Number five, no one size fits all best lens implant. So many patients come in and say, I want the best lens implant. Well, there is no best lens implant. It depends on your vision goals after surgery. For some patients, they may be bird watchers or tennis players, and they prioritize having the best distance vision and depth perception and they won't mind the trade-off of needing reading glasses for up close. Other patients may prioritize reading up close or at the computer without glasses. And some patients may want to be free from glasses for everything. With your surgeon, your main discussion before surgery should be about what your vision goals are after surgery, and secondarily, you should discuss what the best lens implant might be for your eyes to reach this goal. Those are our five secrets that every patient should know before having modern cataract surgery. 
Let us know what you think. Like and subscribe to the channel and let us know what else you'd like to know about modern cataract surgery.